Good evening, my lovelies. Happy Saturday. Uh, I hope everyone is doing well. I hope everyone is having a good weekend. Uh, on Saturday nights, we are now going to be doing Dragon Saturdays. Woo! So to all my new subscribers, welcome. To all my old ones, also welcome. Uh, this will be something new. Again, we will be doing dragons every Saturday night. And this is the first one that we'll be starting. Uh, this one I got from Tapestry Market. It's an 11 count, 40 by 60 centimeters, 148 by 234. This is our favorite generic brand. As we have a nice big picture, I'm using this as a guideline for, whoops. I'm just going to fold it this way. So that I can see which colors I need to use. This one has 43 colors. I am hoping that it'll come out nice. Mostly because as you can tell, there's a lot of block stitching and a little bit of confetti. So tonight, I thought we would start with number two, which is this beautiful... 154 for the DMC. I absolutely love it. Here we go. Even in diamond paintings, it's this beautiful purple burgundy color. So this is what we're going to start on. So we've. I'm going to start with some of this confetti and then we'll make our way and see how far we get. Anyways, I hope everyone's doing good. Uh, please like, comment. Even share my videos, share the love. Uh, again, I hope everyone is doing well. I have parked my needle already, as you can see. I'm going to try and keep this. I'm trying a different angle. If this angle doesn't work for you, please let me know. I'm just trying oh, something new. I've gotten a few needles ready for our night together or morning. Or afternoon, depending on where you are in the world. Again, if my hand's in the way, I will try to, to move it. As you can tell, this is brand new canvas. This one I've had for a while. Um, I actually asked my friend Mikey what I should do on Saturday night. Should I do cats or dragons? Um, we rolled for it. We we did, a, well, he did um, a dice roll out of two. And... The dragon was picked, so we will be doing Saturday Dragons. Did everyone have a good day? I hope so. I know in some parts of Canada, and even, oh my goodness, already a knot. Mm -hmm. Already a knot. Uh, I know, in, and even in some states, it was. it's been a rainy thundery day we were supposed to get thunderstorms uh we got maybe a couple drops of rain there it is and then it decided to stop so it's, we took my dad and i took my son outside to play he played in the water and with some river rock that we have in our backyard And then he uh, helped my mom with weeding. He would put all the weeds. I don't understand why this is already nodding, but sure. You guys can take a look at my giant mess right now until I can get organized. Okay, let's try that. How is that? No. Try it again. No. Okay. Not sure why you're nodding. Let's see how that is. Again, sorry about the mess on my floor. I'm trying to organize all of my things, but I'm stuck in a little corner. The rest of the basement is for my brother and his kitchen. I'm waiting to get some organizer. So I'm waiting until... Uh, 20% day for employees at Walmart when my brother gets back from being in the States. 
he uh, I'm jumping all over the place with topics, but uh, he went to Manhattan actually for some training as he is a pastry chef and a new bakery has opened up in our town that he got hired. Go him. So apparently there's a lot of people from Canada there. They're there for almost three to four weeks, depending on when they went. And yeah, put my hands not in the way. I'll try to move it. So that's where he's at. Yes, I, I like that. This is what happens when you have a slanted floor. Everything just falls. And that was my threader and my beeswax. And now I'm kicking my camera. So give me one moment. I'm just going to be all over the place. Wasn't expecting my wax and my needle threader to fall. So we're going to put that there. We're going to put that there. I'm going to try to get all comfy cozy again. I'm so sorry about the mess. This is what you get when you're stuck in a corner. Hence, you know, my crafty corner. I'm going to move the camera again. Maybe I'll zoom it in a little bit more. Ay, ay, ay. Yeah, this is not being edited. What you see is what you get. So you get the disaster. Amanda. Apparently a naughty, naughty, very naughty canvas. Eventually it'll stop nodding. This canvas is for me, so I don't really mind the back being all over the place. I just don't feel like doing a stitch, cutting, doing another stitch, cutting. So we're just going to do all the co blue confetti and then we will get into like these big, big spots. So this is the dragon right here. This is all the background number 27 along with all this little blue, blue dots. I will put this in the, sorry, I will link, I will put the link for this canvas in the description box below i am so sorry apparently words are hard tonight uh, i hope everybody has a drink i hope every, uh, you have a cross stitch or even a diamond painting maybe it's dragon themed maybe it's not you decide i just like i said i have dragons cross stitch i've had this in my stash since i think february so I figured why not? Yes, I have a lot of cross stitches now to do, but that is okay. Make sure, whoop, make sure there's no knots, but guess what? There is. I've even beeswaxed this and I put beeswax on it. So here is my wax. It's a little messy because, oh no, it even broke. Oh, I'm gonna have to find that plastic piece. Um, yeah, I've had to melt it already, but I'm not the greatest at melting it. I do have two more of these, thankfully, and if I have to, I will buy more. Here you guys go. I normally have this cross stitch a lot closer to me than what you see. It's usually like up here more than than down in my lap, but I digress. We're just going to do it this way. So yeah, I hope you guys grab a snack, a drink, a diamond painting, a cross stitch, and you cross stitch away. Um going back to to my day because i like i said i'm going all over the place yeah we took my son outside he was helping my mom clean up as she was weeding the grass yeah not the garden the grass so we have a weed that has taken over our backyard and it's easy to pull out it's just 
all over the place and we don't even know why this happened a few years ago and we tore out all of the grass in the backyard we cleaned up all of the dirt so literally my my backyard was a giant mud hole and then we got new dirt we got new grass and now it is i'm just taking a look in the back just to make sure it's not knotted please it's real perfect not knotted anymore yes i'm just going all over the place with it doesn't matter it's my cross stitch the back and most of it will get covered anyways once i start number 27 which is the color 939 and if you know it from diamond paintings it's almost like a a navy like a black navy blue so it's this one here i have the diamond painting so it looks like this just not shiny So it's not black, it's like a dark navy blue, which is my background for this cross stitch. I'm gonna go down here. It's also hard to get up here because of the, um, the frame. Again, I'm just going to, how is that? Is that a little bit better? I hope so. I can put it back between my lap if you guys want, if that works out better. I'm just trying to get a good, good feeling. This is kind of like my uh, guinea pig one. I know I do the keeper on Monday, so I'm just trying to figure out different ways that this works out better for you guys, or my back's not going to hurt, or um, I'm not going to roll back, so I am on a folding chair. I found them. They were in my garage. So that I'm not rolling back on you guys. Okay. No, there. Yeah. So that was my day. We spent it outside. We played inside. Um, like I said on my diamond painting video, my son turns three tomorrow. So my partner went out and got him a vanilla ice cream cake because he really likes ice cream. So we did that. I still have to finish wrapping three of his gifts. Um, bought him some toys. I know my parents bought him some stuff. So tomorrow should be fun. I'm not 100% sure if he is going to my in-laws on Monday to celebrate with them. I'm like I said, not sure, but we shall see. Um, oh. But here you go. I'm also paying attention to the time because, like I said, so this. Oh, I did not. No, that's okay. We'll just pull it through now. Oh, to self, I need to get needle minders. No, to myself. Get a needle minder. So you stick a magnet here, and then I can just stick my needle there. I do plan to order more cross stitch and some more accessories. Uh, I also have another un boxing some point i'm waiting for a package really i'm waiting for another package to come in so yeah and then we'll do saturdays with dragons mondays will be all about the keepers um and then i'll do my diamond painting Sorry for putting my hand in the way. This table is my diamond painting table as well. I'm just leaning against it. Um, just so I'm not leaning against my computer desk. Which is where I'm recording all my videos. Including this one right now. Oh, 
there's this one. So, yeah. So there is a few different. Ay, ay, ay. I felt that one not. Nice thing is, pretty easy to take them out, though. It's just annoying. Nice thing is, I do have long nails, so for the most part, it's easy to unknot them. Say most part, sometimes I stick the needle in and then I slowly take it apart bit by bit without making a bigger knot. At least I try. I really, really try. Sorry, I go quiet when I'm doing stuff like this just because I get so annoyed and nobody needs to hear me be frustrated. Also, hi, Citrarella. Thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. Um, thank you, Mikey, for all the laughs that you give me in my comment section. Thank you, Diane, and everybody else that follows me. Um, like I said, eventually I will have an ending title screen, I guess you could say, an ending screen. My friend Ange is doing it. So hi, Ange. There we go. No more knots. So, yeah. I'm going to kind of put this on an angle so that you guys can see. Like I said, I do have other threads started. I'm just going to push this back just a tiny little bit without making a giant mess. There we go. There. Basically, I'm making my way here. And then we can do all of this. And then once I'm in here, I will get all of this confetti. How does... That's not where I want the needle. How does that sound? Because that sounds like a plan to me. And then at least there's a little bit done tonight. And we can feel proud of ourselves. Just not when it knots. Like I said, not when it knots. Anybody know why false knots? Is it just because I'm pulling it too hard or too fast? Because I feel like I'm not even really stitching a lot. I'm more taking up the knots for you guys. I mean, we have a fair few stitches, but I definitely feel like I'm pulling out more knots than I am stitching. So I'm going to hold my thumb there. I'm going to try to do... This. I'm going to try something different. I am not a left-handed person, as you can tell. I am a righty. But if I can prevent knots, I definitely will. Here. 
I want this one. So again, sorry if my hand is in the way. Again, I'm just trying to, to figure it out. But see, we've gotten a few stitches. I'm excited. Do this. So yeah, let me know how your day is. Let me know what you're working on, whether it's diamond painting, uh, cross stitch. What have you? Oh, sorry, I did not mean to hit my camera. Go see. Very nice. Okay, so give me one moment. I'm you're gonna go on a, a ride with actually, you know what? I am going to stop the video here. I am going to get myself into a better position for you guys. I will be back momentarily. Just gonna read. And I'm back. We will see if this is a little better for you. Just going to do this. So I kind of do half stitches sometimes like this. Make sure there's no knots. So basically what I'm going to do now is I'm going to kind of go maybe down or I'll go up here and go around. I don't know. We'll see as I go. Oh, I got it stuck. So yeah, we'll, we'll make sure there's no knots back here. I can kind of feel it when there is. this because then I can maybe there is a knot no there's not well there is kind of but nothing too too bad I'll just pull it just like that No, no, not that one. There we go. Yes, I talk to myself a lot when I when I cross stitch. A little different than diamond painting, but I talk to my floss. Yeah, I hope everybody got a drink or a snack. Maybe a diamond painting or a cross stitch so that you can... Uh, cross stitch along with me I'm honestly trying to think of what else I can say as uh, we go on this journey together my day is you know filled with my little one we played some games. His favorite is I Spy. Oh, that's perfect. Um, we cuddled. We watched Miss Rachel for a little bit. He played some matching games on his tablet. Uh, 
Um, I watch some YouTube videos myself on my phone as he watches Miss Rachel, unless he wants me to get involved. Uh, so my son is very, very independent in, in playing. He really doesn't want you to play with him. He more so wants you to watch him as he plays. Um, unless he comes up and he grabs you or he wants to play a game with you. Um, yeah, he's, he's independent that way. He talks a lot. He can say full sentences. Uh, he kind of, he kind of gives you, hold on, I got stuck on my wire. Oh, this one. Yeah. I somehow got stuck on my wire. Mm -hmm. uh, so he, yeah, he's very independent in that regard. He kind of wants you to play with him, but he doesn't. Again, COVID baby. Um... I don't really have friends that have kids his age um, and all of my cousins, their kids are a fair bit older. So yeah, I'm going to be signing him up for some programs hopefully soon. Uh, come. September, October, just because he does start school in 2024. So get him accustomed to being around kids would be nice. Um, he doesn't necessarily have to play with them, but at least if he's surrounded by, by kids, that'd be, that'd be nice. I know my partner and I... Uh, we've talked about putting him in karate. Um, maybe basketball when he's a little bit older. I'm not 100% sure. Um, yeah, I'm just... We're, we're taking it one day at a time, really. Seeing what he likes. I also don't drive at all. I will not lie. I get anxiety on the road. You do not want me on the road. And it's not because I'm a bad driver. It's just other drivers make me anxious. So the one thing that my partner and I can say about myself is I totally trust my partner with my life in the car. I never get anxious when he's behind the wheel. I... Um, remark on other people's driving skills. Oops, sorry. Uh, although I don't drive, I kind of question how some people have gotten their license. And I'm sure there's a lot of people that are like me that just, that even drive and wonder how people get their license. Let's feel if there's any knots. No, we are golden. And look, we haven't even fully finished of I, I made like four just in case. So we are golden. I love this generic brand. I really do. I really wish they had a name instead of the crinkle bag or generic brand. No name brand. Yeah, we'll see how far we get tonight, how much you really want to listen to me. Again, thank you for my new subs. Thank you to my old ones for watching and following me. Uh, if you have any questions. Oh, no, I did get a knot. This last one. Uh, please feel free to ask. I'm never not going to answer a question. I also answer my comments whenever I can. So if you leave me a comment, believe me, 
I will answer them. You can join my, if you have Discord, join my Discord. Um, yeah, join my Discord. We can have a lot of fun on there. You can follow me on Instagram, Amanda's Crafty Corner. It's the same image that you see at the beginning of my videos. Uh, I don't have a Facebook group. I am not planning to make one. Again, I really don't use Facebook. I use the Messenger where I talk to people. And that's about it. Uh, yeah, I really... I'm not a fan of Facebook. I've never really been a fan of Facebook. I have some friends that I've known for 20 years that live in the States. And I basically keep it for them. Uh, so that we know what's going on in each other's lives. Uh, when MSN was bought out by Skype. But none of us really used Skype at the time either. So, yeah. Yeah. Discord. Discord is, I have a, a server. I will put the, um, the link in the description box below. And yeah, come hang out with, with all of my lovelies. I post up, um, the links to my videos when I upload them. Um, I let them know that I'm doing the dragon Saturdays. And yeah, it's just a real good time. I do not post any pictures. I'm going to tell you this now. There will be no pictures of my son. On any discord um, I just I'm not comfortable with it if you ask me for a picture I might give it to you as long as I, I I've known you for a little while but I am very wary of um, posting anything with my son on it just because you never know and I'm gonna get into this you never know uh, again I said that I took the ECE program, the Early Childhood Education Program. Uh, when I took that program, we had to do a course on child services and child abuse. Um, and so from there, it was a lot of you never know people. Um, we had talks about even some of the baby monitors there people will try to get on the wi-fi and there were videos and horror stories of you know people getting into the baby monitors and speaking to the bit like you could hear full like an ad adults speaking into the monitor telling the children what to do no no just no no And even with pictures online, um, if you put a hashtag, like hashtag happy birthday, hashtag blah, 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 it is no, your account, although private, that picture is no longer private. It is out there for everyone to see. So I am sorry until my son can say, yes, mommy, you can post my pictures. No, you will never see. I posted once and then I took it down. I will I just, no. I'm sorry. My son is adorable. Don't get me wrong. Oh, I put that in the wrong spot. Uh, oh, no, I didn't. Right here. But, yeah. Even people that have known me for 30, you know, let's say 30 years. I'm 33 in case anybody's wondering. Yes, I, I put my age. Ooh. I've known people for from since I was three years old, unless they ask me for my their my my goodness words. My son's pictures, no, I will not post. 
yeah, that's just me. That is just me. I am a protective mama bear. I am protective of my friends as well. Uh, somebody, her arms, my friends, believe me, I will go Italian on their butts. Um, we were at a barbecue last week and somebody was saying, oh, Italians like to keep bodies in their trunks. And I looked at his friend and I was, I gave a very serious face. And I go, what makes you think we keep them in the trunks? And he kind of looked at me and I'm like, mm, no, what, what makes you think we, we keep bodies in the trunks? No, we really don't. But I was joking. Don't take it literally. But yeah. But that, again, just me. Silly old me. And I'm just trying to think of what else to say, really. Really trying to think of what to say. And look, we got, look, here, look. We got this section done. We got some confetti done. We are making our way through this. I just need to look at the time. We are doing good for time before it yells at me. So yeah, I think I'm going to make my way up. And we'll do this big patch here up until I get to... We're going to do... We're going to do this patch here up until about there. And then we'll make our way... Maybe down this way until uh, probably about here. It's just hard because this isn't like the, this is in the way. So you can only get to a certain point. So yeah. So I'll probably get up to like where it says number two. And then we'll make our way down again up to here here we'll see we'll see how we do for time we'll see how my back feels um just because i can't really sit back because yeah i'm as far as i can be without um without having to move the camera but i think we're doing good for time I'm just holding the frame now with my left hand. So I'm doing this one-handed. Which is fine because there's no knots now. And we're getting to, you know, it's not exactly done, but we're slowly getting there. I'm just going to... I'm going to go up and down. I want to go this way. There we go. Does anybody have any plans for tomorrow? I know a lot of people go to work on Monday. I do not. I took Monday off. But yeah, anybody got plans for Sunday? Any diamond painting, cross stitch? Does anybody actually do perler beads? I showed a perler bead design in one of my other videos. I do plan to do that on my channel soon. I just have to remember which box they're in because they're packed away. 
or I could buy more, I guess. Just a small tray of multicolored or two trays and do some designs for you guys to see. They're a lot of fun. And then you take an iron to them. I don't know why I did it that way, but that's okay. I do it this way. Um, and then you take an iron, like I said, and then you just melt the back and then you put it in water so that it, um, basically the cold water makes it freeze. And then I'm doing this new thing where I'm going to mod podge the back just to keep everything together. I don't know what happened there. Sometimes this is what happens to the canvas when it's pulled a lot, but that's okay because you're not going to see it once all the stitches are in. Like even as I get further and further down, when I get to number 27, I should be good. Where am I going? Yeah. So yeah. Once the canvas is washed and everything, you won't see it. And yeah, again, I'm just taking a look at the time. I have whoop, a drink here. I might take a drink of my Coke Zero. You did do the cross here, right? Now I need to look. Yeah, I did. I did. Just looks funny because of the piece of Ada. And yes, as long as your X's, like your line, so... Even if you go top right to bottom left, it's still facing the same way. And that's what you want. You want your X's to all be facing the same way. I just do it that way so that the back looks just a little bit neater, but it really doesn't matter what the back looks like. Uh, once you wash it, dry it, and iron it, it should be good. As long as there are no, see, no knots. There's your back. And again, those big long strings, they will be covered by the other colors. I just wanted to get Number two out of the way. Now we're getting it done, which is good. Slowly but surely we are getting this one done. Uh, for those of you who don't know, Trappist Free Market, I actually found on Facebook. It was a Facebook ad. And I decided, hey, I'm going to take a chance with it. So I did. I ordered a few cross stitch. I do have a dragon that is a DIY. It is 30 colors. I do want to work on it. I just need a bigger frame. So um, I digress. Anyways, so Tapestry Market, they only sell cross stitch. They sell all of your accessories for cross stitch. Um, they usually do, if you buy four, you'll get one free. Buy seven, get two. Is it buy seven and get two free or buy nine and get two free? 
I think it's buy four, get one free. Buy seven, get one free. Buy nine, get two free. Again, I'm, I can't remember. I know there's mystery boxes. I, I remember that much with them. Um, I can take a look for you if you want. Uh, but yeah, so that I, anyways, it doesn't matter. I found Tapestry Market on from a Facebook ad, decided to give them a chance. So I've had some of their cross stitches in a box or in my room really for a while. And then from watching other YouTubers like Stitcherella, uh, Lovecraft Forever, uh, Marianne's Creative Space, and I think that's it for those who cross stitch that I watch. They've they've really gotten me into doing more and more cross stitch. Uh, and again, unfortunately, with the way that this program works, I will be right back. All right, my lovelies, I am back. We will probably do this for another 10 or 15 minutes. Oh, no. <coughs> I'm so sorry. I did not mean to come back and just cough like that. I am, again, very, very sorry. I did not mean to come back and all of a sudden... Have a lovely coughing fit. But as I was saying before that, I will probably do this for another 10 or so minutes. Uh, thank you for those that have watched this far along. You guys are amazing. You guys are great. We are slowly going to get through this. And like I said, every Saturday we will be working on this dragon. Whether or not we get to another color next week. I'm not 100% sure. I'm, yeah, we, we will see this. I, I won't lie, I don't pre-record. I just pick a time whenever my son is either with his dad, who does live with me, by the way, because uh, sometimes he'll put him to bed, sometimes I'll put him to bed. Again, we like to switch off on who's doing stuff so that it doesn't feel like one parent is doing everything. Um, and then I kind of just pick when I record. Sorry. Just moving my camera again so you guys can see. Yeah, so I kind of just pick a time, I record, and then I do very little to no editing to my videos. And then I just upload them. And then when you get them, you get them. I am me. That's all I can say. Um, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. I try to also make sure nobody else is around. Because if people are around, they are very loud. Again, the Italian household, we don't know quiet. Um, I try not to get too, too loud. Sometimes my dad annoys me, so I do tend to raise my voice just a wee bit. Um, and I try not to do it in front of my son just because every time... My dad and I argue. My dad is kind of over the top loud and it scares him. Where his other grandparents, they don't yell or raise their voice or they're very quiet people. I'm very quiet. They're quieter than my family. I will say that. And yeah. Look at that. We are slowly getting done. Oh my goodness, if I could find, oh, no, I keep going to the same hole over and over again. There it is. So like I said, we'll probably do this for another few more minutes or when, 
yeah, we'll do this for a few more minutes. I'll start another piece of floss. And then you guys can, you know, be free to do whatever you like. But yes, this is Dragon Saturdays. I don't think I have any dragon diamond paintings. If I do, well, dragon Saturdays will be both cross stitch and diamond painting, but we will only be working on one at a time. Not going to do two diamond paintings. Well, that's a lie. I'm not going to do a diamond painting and a dragon at the same time on the same night. We will do one crafty dragon at a time, just like I won't be doing two keepers at the same time on Monday night. We're going to keep doing the Moon River. And then once she is done, we will move on to one of the other keepers. And yeah, because they're a whole collection and dragons, you know, there's lots of dragon cross stitch out there. Will I get them all? No, because I'm kind of picky about what my dragons look like. I just really liked the way this one looked. It's a girl and a dragon. I love fantasy. Yeah, once this piece of floss is done, which is probably going to be soon, We will finish out. Apparently it's like, mm, you need to end me now. So here we are. You get to see this part. That's how you thread it. Gonna try one more. We're going to do one more stitch and then I will end this piece of floss. Right. Okay, so what I do, I'm flipping it over for you guys. Again, ignore the giant mess. It is here. I'm going to go through. Go through here. No. Not through the whole thing. Just. Through. There we go. Push that there. When it, wa when it wants to come out, my chin hits my camera. Okay, we're going to do this then. Go through here and here. This way. It does not want to work the way that I had planned. There we go. Go through here. Pull it through. And one more time. I'm going to go through here. Pull it up. Grab my lovely scissors. And chop. And there we go. So here is the back. Here is the lovely back. And here is what we have. Again, sorry about the mess there. And that is what we have done. So we did some of the 
confetti and a little bit of i believe that's the wing yeah and a little bit of the dragon wing this is all background all of this is background so again thank you for watching i hope everybody has a good night a good sunday i will see you all on my next video bye